Can we just roll it and then we can edit out whatever? Hurry up, I farted in here. It's starting to stink real bad. Oh, there's, there's an, another one. <laughs> there's an exhaust fan. Quick, do you have the key on you? Lock his ass in. What's up? Welcome back to Metalhead Whiskey Snobs, everyone. I'm Ryan. He's Fish. Today, we got a special guest. All the way from the other side of town, Mr. Shane Clush. Hey, what's up, everybody? <laughs> hey, man. Going hey, on, hey, dude. hey, Johnny. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Hello. Uh, yeah, we all know Shane from his YouTube channel, Clash. Yep. Today we're gonna try out uh, some whiskey and uh, talk some shit with Shane. When we uh, take a look at the whiskey, we'll see if you can see anything that you might want to try today, dude. Take your time, you know. Oh my right goodness. There. This one seems to be pretty nice. Oh, what you got there? That well, is the, the old George Dickel Barrel Select, huh? Yeah, I have not had that one before. I am a fan of the Dickel. We know. Yeah. We've heard <laughs> of the last Dickel. <laughs> Subscribe to his channel to find out. <laughs> <laughs> You're not going to see too much. <laughs> You'll see enough. That's what she said. <laughs> right on. So uh, let's check this out, dude. Chose the George Dickel Barrel Select. It's coming in at 43% ABV, 86% proof. It's probably looking real nice and smooth, dude. Let's get this cap open like you're manscaping. <laughs> <laughs> That's on his Patreon. Oh, man. Look at that. That's on my OnlyFans. <laughs> George Deco Barrel Select. Let's pop the cork. So yeah, man, tell us about your YouTube channel and uh, what's been going on lately. Uh, so I got like three YouTube channels. I've got my main channel, which is just my last name, Clash. I do treasure hunting. You've probably seen Johnny and Ryan in some of my videos over there. We've been to Tennessee and here in Colorado, panning for gold. It's all treasure hunting. I do a new video every week on that channel. I also have a daily channel, Clash Guitars, where I have a full-scale guitar luthier shop that I'm building built it from the ground up. It's looking awesome. Um, you can follow daily uploads over there at Clash Guitars. And then I have another channel where I look at coins and like, I'm busy. I'm really busy all the time. Dude, if you're ever bored, go subscribe <laughs> to his channel. Yeah. Yeah. He will keep always, you entertained. Always doing something, trying to keep busy. That's and right. uh, it's good to have a break once in a while. I enjoy going on adventures with Shane, man. We've been to a couple places. We've been up to Seattle. Oh yeah. Up to Cape Disappointment. Wisconsin. That was awesome with the King Tides, remember that? Oh yeah. And, and uh, Wisconsin. And Wisconsin Minnesota. where we found the fossils. Tennessee we went. We yeah. been in a cave and broke a person's water pipe to their house. <laughs> that was <laughs> his fault. Well, that was all him. No. <laughs> you see, I don't fit in the cave. <laughs> So your class channel, you do treasure hunting, and you hunt for it, gold. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. It's um, It keeps me occupied and not always out of trouble, but it's fun and it beats having a boss. Definitely. So right. it's definitely not whiskey, but just to go with your theme of treasure hunting, we've got you a little bottle of gold slug. Oh, hell yeah, <laughs> dude. And that sucker out. <laughs> for that out. Get hey, I've already done that. I've already actually made a video panning this stuff out and finding out exactly how much gold is in it. So yes. Yes. Well, I'm just going to drink well. this one. So. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, man. So let's get it on the nose. Wow, that's smooth. It's like, rich. you wouldn't think it's whiskey. You can't even smell alcohol on it. It is nice. It is nicely hidden. I'll give it that. Smells like whiskey. <laughs> I got a little apple orchard off of it. Maybe even a caramel apple, like a candy apple. Like, I'm about to get down the mouth. Let's go. It's much better than just regular dickle. It's different, way different. That's delicious. It's advanced dickle. Yeah, it is. That is it's really like nice. corn dickle. <laughs> it ain't too harsh. No, it's not too. Um, it's it's well, not too easy either. I mean, it's only it's only an eighty six proofer, so it's not a very high proof whiskey. It's a to me. It's a to me. It's a it's a real crushable whiskey. I could drink a, quite a few of those, no problem at all, man. I enjoy the flavor on that. I think it's really smooth. Fill her up. <laughs> Top it up. Come on, keep it all the way up to here. No, no, no. <laughs> all right, so 
on your uh, channel we see you do a lot of traveling videos sure uh, do I saw recently you went to New York and oh yeah dug through the cracks oh yeah yeah of and the streets in New York yeah dude I did that um I did it in 2019 first that was the first time I did it in New York and I found all kinds of stuff there's there's videos on YouTube with that and you can see everything I found if you're interested in seeing some guy digging through the dirt <laughs> in the middle of the night in New York City feel free to go check it out but yeah dude if you saw the video you saw what I found that and that's real so many people in the comments are like oh that's fake dude it's real 100% I promise is that once you got through all the feces and there was, dude, there was like, boogers oh my goodness, dude, I, there's like dreadlocks I'm pulling out of the cracks. It's just like Funny it's crack. crack. And I, crack. I, there may have been, I think it was, might have been melted in. I didn't find any crack. Just like <laughs> crack in New York. Laying on the sidewalk. Yeah, so. But yeah, there's definitely gold there. If you want to know why there's gold and diamonds in the streets and the sidewalk cracks in New York City, um, feel free to come over and visit the show. So uh, yeah, man. I know you do a lot of gold panning and stuff. Yep. Uh, prospecting. Yep. All, kind all of different varieties. And yeah. What is the most gold you've ever found on on one in one day? As oh, far one as, day. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I get this question a lot on podcasts and interviews and stuff, and it's not all that much. I personally enjoy the adventure. Like the gold is just like the bonus. Yep, yep. But uh, up in Alaska, um, at Crow Creek Mine. It's a pay to pan place. They go out there with a bucket loader, they scoop up the dirt in the river, coming right off the glaciers, and you go over there and you pan for gold. And I found a, I forget how big, it was the biggest nugget. It was about that big. I can't remember the weight, but it's you on my channel. Size, right? It was about that big. <laughs> it was true. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, uh, Alaska, up in Crow Creek Mine, Alaska, Moose Pass, Alaska. That's what I was Yeah. Yeah. I gotta moose, go back moose up Moose Pass, Alaska? Moose Pass, Alaska. Oh, moose Gas. I thought he said. Moose Pass. Moose, moose Gas? Ass. <laughs> he got the moose ass. <laughs> it's, it's, so yeah, dude, obviously you got Clutch Guitars going. Oh yeah. I hear that the business is coming back. After all these years of being on the shelf and stuff, dude, you're finally getting back to what you originally made YouTube all about that's when you it. started this that's up. That's exactly that's right. building guitars. Yep. Uh, hopefully, dude, you got the same contacts. You can get right back into business, and uh, we can start showing us some of your some of your guitars, maybe in an episode down the line. But tell us a little bit about your new shop that you're building right now. Yeah, so I just purchased a home with a giant shop. Well, that's actually I purchased a giant shop with a little house next to it, <laughs> and uh, so that's the main reason I purchased the house so I could have this wood shop and get my guitar company built uh, started up again. Yes, you know, before I moved to Colorado, mm -hmm. I was like broke, and I was like, I'm gonna buy a van, I'm gonna take a huge loan out, buy a van and make like a mobile guitar repair thing and just drive around Denver. Drive. Fit right in with the locals. With all the man. Yeah. yeah. But um, now it's it's actually happened. I have a full scale guitar shop and everything. And now with my my main YouTube channel, I got like 180,000 subscribers or something. Get the word out a little bit easier, which is a good position to be in, which is treasure hunting, which I've never done before I even moved to Colorado. I did a little bit of metal detecting in Pennsylvania before I moved here, but yeah, just it just kind of took off when I moved here. And just sticking around, nothing just, serious, man. Until just messing you got around, here, right? And then it took right off. Well, even when I started here, I was just like, I'm just going to take my camera and put it on YouTube because my friends back in Pennsylvania. I didn't think they would believe me, like if I told them I panned for gold. So I like brought my, just had my phone, found some gold, showed it on camera, and everybody's like, "Oh, wow, that is real!" And then I just kept doing it, and I continued doing that. And yes, the guitar thing will be coming together. Kleshgold.com to plug myself there. Kleshgold.com is really where. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> Have another shot! <laughs> <laughs> You'll be able to find my custom guitars and anything else on my Clutch Guitars channel on YouTube. And uh, that's pretty much all you need to know. Oh yeah, dude. So you came here and you're a true definition of a gold digger. Yes, <laughs> I really am. Just an ugly one. And the older witness. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> Correct. Didn't bring us no whiskey or nothing. No. Up with liking, you guys can go to the senior center and oh, yeah. <laughs> hunt down some lady folk. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe so. I do know a crazy rich one. <laughs> oh God. What you got coming up in the future, man, that you want to tell uh, the camera about to keep an eye out for? If you want to know anything about what I'm doing, if you care, uh, I like metal, I like guitars, I like hunting for mushrooms, I like all kinds of treasure hunting. 
you can find out what I'm doing every single day on Clutch Guitars on YouTube or my main channel Clutch. And that's pretty much everything that you need to know. Right on, man. Thanks for uh, coming into Metalhead Whiskey Snobs today. Yeah, thanks for good, having me. Good to catch up and uh, get the fuck out. Yeah, just out here, man. He just answered his own question. He's like, ah. it ain't, no, it ain't bad at all. <laughs>